Now, your WLKY weather with meteorologist Daniel Johnson. Yeah, Hurricane Lee getting closer and closer to northeastern Maine and Nova Scotia. You can see the latest satellite imagery here. Still a nice little spin associated with it, but it is beginning to weaken in terms of its lowering its winds, but the winds are also expanding out from the eye. So we're still expecting very gusty winds from basically Nantucket, Boston, all the way through coastal Maine, and of course into Newfoundland. And a lot of flooding, storm surge. They're already getting reports of very large waves uh, hitting New England right now. So that's all moving in, and it will likely make landfall in Newfoundland uh, as we head into your Saturday. So here's the latest path, still a Category 1. We're going to get the latest at 11 o'clock, so be sure to tune in uh, on WLKY with Jay Cardosi. He'll have the latest on the 11 o'clock advisory. All right now, winds are at 80 miles per hour, moving north-northeast at 20 miles per hour, and here we go. It's making that landfall just west and south of Halifax and just east of Bangor, Maine. That lifts north and it's going to be throwing a lot of uh, ocean water into the bay here uh, between Halifax and Maine. So a lot of flooding expected as this makes landfall tomorrow. For us, our weather is just terrific today. Not a cloud in the sky. It was gorgeous, low humidity and there's still not a cloud out there. The sky is clear. There's a live look outside. Downtown Louisville, picture perfect. Calm weather, 71 the current temperature. The humidity is 45%. We're gonna keep the humidity low as we head through the weekend, but we will increase a chance for rain. We'll increase our rain chance, I should say, uh, for the second half of the weekend. 81 was today's official high, so close to average. We should be at 83. But starting tomorrow, our average high will be 82. And we're going to be right around that for the next couple of days. We'll dip below that Sunday with the extra clouds and the chance for a few showers. And then next week, we actually have a nice warm-up set to arrive. We're not talking 90s, but we're talking mid to maybe upper 80s by the middle of next week. So the warm weather's not done with just yet. Temperatures out the door, quite cool, especially from Seymour to North Vernon to Scottsburg, mid-50s already. These areas could drop into the upper 40s overnight tonight. Most of us right now in the 60s to near 70. We're tracking a cold front to our northwest. That's our next weather maker set to bring us increased clouds and a chance for rain for the second half of the weekend. We're going to get more into the detail of that rain and the timing coming up in just a couple of seconds. But tonight we're clear. 57 for the low in the city, but outlying areas, upper 40s and low 50s. Tomorrow, a mix of clouds and sun, so definitely more clouds than we had today, but also some sunshine out there. Average temperatures in the low 80s. Loose City, we're in town tomorrow. It's going to be a dry game, temperatures in the 70s as you head there to the stadium. Here's your Bourbon and Beyond forecast through the weekend. 81 Saturday, looking good, but a few showers possible Sunday, especially late in the day. A little bit cooler, 75. So we're looking at Bruno Mars taking the stage shortly after 9 p.m. There could be a few showers, so let's talk about it. Futurecast does show a little bit of cloud cover tomorrow. Not a lot. We're dry. Showers staying south. Then Saturday night, a few sprinkles. Mostly dry through midday Sunday. And then late Sunday, we'll start to see some of these showers roll in. Here we are, 9 o'clock. Bruno Mars takes the stage. It looks mostly dry, but look how close those showers are. So we'll have to watch radar closely. And then next week, Rick, it's smooth sailing. Nothing but sunshine and some clouds here and there. By Wednesday, Thursday, we're in the mid to upper 80s. So, you know, it's still technically summer. Yeah. But fall is eight days away, but the warm weather's not done yet. It's going to be a nice start to uh, fall, right? It really is. Yeah, <laughs> dry in 80s. All right. Thanks, Daniel. Mm -hmm.